Hello, and this is Sunny. Welcome back. Today, my topic is IPv6 address classification. There are three types of IPv6 addresses: unicast, multicast, and anycast. Like IPv4 classes A, B, and C, IPv6 unicast uses one-to-one -one association between two individual devices. Each unicast destination address uniquely identifies a single receiver on a network. Unicast has several types for different purposes, such as local link unicast, global. Unicast and several others. I will talk about them in details in next video. In IPv4, a host needs a broadcast communication when it does not know the receiver's address. Broadcast is IPv4 type of communications, where messages from a single sender can be heard. By all other devices on the same broadcast network, in IPv6, there is no broadcast address or broadcast domain. Instead, IPv6 uses multicast. Multicast is one-to-many type of communications. IPv6 multicast addresses use the prefix. FF zero zero colon colon slash eight, which is equivalent to the IPv four multicast address two hundred twenty four dot zero dot zero dot zero slash four. A packet sent to the multicast group always have a unicast source address. A multicast address can never be source address. IPv6 has many different types of multicast addresses for different purposes. Here, I introduce two types of multicast addresses only: well-known multicast addresses and solicited node addresses. Well-known multicast addresses are reserved for predefined groups of devices, such as all nodes. And all routers multicast groups. FF zero two colon colon one is all nodes address, which means all nodes identified by this address on the local network can get the messages. FF zero two colon colon two is all routers address, which means all routers on a local network segment. Can hear multicast messages with this address as the destination. So listed node addresses are automatically created by prepending the so listed node multicast prefix FF zero two colon colon one colon FF zero zero colon zero 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 slash one o four. To the last 24 bits of the unicast or anycast address. For example, and if we have IPv6 global unicast,、uh, this IP address and its corresponding solicited node multicast address is look like this, and you might notice the last 20. Four bits is the same. A host is required to join the solicited node multicast group for each of its configured unicast or anycast addresses. You may ask why a host needs a solicited node address. Because it is useful and necessary for link clear address resolution. With a neighbor discover protocol on the link, without disturbing all nodes on the local network. I will introduce neighbor discovery protocol in a separate video. 
The third type IPv6 address classification is Anycast. Anycast is one to nearest association. It is typically used by routers. An IPv6 Anycast address is an address that can be signed to a group of routers. In other words, multiple routers can have the same Anycast address. A packet sent to Anycast address is forwarded to the nearest router according to routing protocols. The determination of the nearest router is calculated on the basis of the number of hops, distance, efficiency, latency, and cost. In summary, IPv6 unicast is one-to-one -one type of communications. Multicast is one-to-many type of communications. Anycast is one to any one of the group of type of communications. When we send the Anycast packet, we mean send the packet to the closest member of this group. I hope this video is helpful. Thank you very much and see you next time. Oh, don't forget to subscribe.